Hey, Scott Willicke here with an overview of another awesome Grape City product, Active Report Server. With the Active Report Server, we created a designer that is focused on what the end user wants, and we remove the things that they don't want. This is completely different from anyone else in the market. Instead of requiring the user to rely on the IT staff, you can start showing them how to open the report in the designer and modify it themselves. They go out to the logical model, they see the same terms that they talk about with their other colleagues and that they see in the applications that they write in their documents, and they'll recognize those and they'll know exactly how to use them. They're going to recognize them and say, ha, there's a sales number that I see every day. That's exactly what I want. And they just drag and drop it onto the report and they see it. And then they say, well, I want to total this up for the day. Well, they'll see date in there along with the sale and they'll be able to do that. It'll be all familiar terms to them. They can expand one of these numeric values and the totals show up automatically. They can do an average or a min, a max, something like that, and they could just drag and drop it into the report and it'll work right away. They drag and drop them into the table. They drag them into a chart. They resort the table and regroup it and everything right there on the surface. It's Active Report Server that'll deal with the SQL behind the scenes to make all this happen and generate the expressions and all the aggregation that usually a developer or someone on the IT staff needs to understand. But this tool takes care of all that for the end user. This is that rich drag and drop designer that you see in desktop applications, but it's all browser based. And it doesn't matter if they're using Google Chrome or Firefox or Internet Explorer, it works in all the browsers. And it doesn't matter if they're on Windows or not, it works on different platforms as well. It looks and feels like an immersive desktop application, but they don't have to install anything. One of the things we did in Active Reports Server is we built scalability in. You can deploy all your reports to one server, and as you need increased scalability, you can add additional agents. And those additional agents, you don't need to do anything with them, you don't need to manage them. Active Report Server will load balance the report execution and exporting automatically across multiple servers. So the developers don't need to code any of that logic anymore. The user just comes and gets the report, or maybe it's scheduled to run, and it'll automatically be scaled because those reports will run across multiple servers. We built caching in automatically. It's cached on the server, and we deliver that cached result to the user. So the users get the reports faster than they ever have before, and the server does less work. If you've got some reports where you need up-to-the-minute data, or you don't want to risk giving stale data to a user, that's fine. Go right here, turn off caching, or maybe make it expire every 10 minutes. If you're in an environment where you have a lot of users requesting reports very often and you do need very active data, you could still cache it even for 5 or 10 minutes. If you have many people coming and requesting that report over the next couple of minutes, that can save a lot of processing time on the server and everybody gets faster results that way. And that's really exciting. That's just some of what Active Report Server can do for your business. I'm Scott Willicke. Thanks for watching and thanks for choosing Grape City.